Hello, I'm Rakesh and today we are going to a waterfall. And I forgot the charger. <laughs> Tipikota waterfalls, Magic Falls and Bhupateshwara waterfall all are located at same place. घर से तो मैं अकेले ही निकला था बट मेरा लक अच्छा है कि मैं वहाँ पे जाने के बाद एक शॉर्ट मूवी क्रू से मिला एंड नेक्स्ट डे आई लॉस्ट माई ड्रोन इन दिस वीडियो वी विल सी हाउ टू रीच यर बेस्ट टाइम टू विजिट दिस प्लेस सम सेफ्टी प्रिकॉशंस बिकॉज लॉट ऑफ पीपल हैव डाइड यर और कुछ देर बाद मैं शेयर करूंगा जो बेस्ट रूट है यू कैन टेक इफ यू आर कमिंग फ्रॉम चेन्नई एंड द वर्स्ट रूट आल्सो टू अवॉइड सो लेट्स स्टार्ट विद हाउ टू रीच हियर लाइक आई सेड अर्लियर ऑल दी थ्री वाटरफॉल्स आर नियर बाय बट वी हैव टू कम टू भूपतेश्वरा टेम्पल दिस इज वेयर एक्चुअली वी कैन पार्क अवर बाइक एंड कार वाइल कमिंग फ्रॉम चेन्नई देर विल बी लॉट ऑफ ऑप्शन बट वी हैव टू टेक द रोड विच ब्रिंग्स अस टू उत्तकोट I modified my route slightly a little more to get out of Chennai as soon as possible and the reason to take this route is This is a very special journey for me because i was trekking after more than a year too much weight removed some unnecessary things from my bag and i left from chennai at 3 the route which i took is the quickest way to get out of chennai aur isi karan main kaha par bhi traffic mein fasa nahi i went on weekdays so there was no rush anywhere After driving for two and a half hours, I got to see a really beautiful sunset. The view kept on getting better because of the forest around me, and I was moving closer towards the mountains. Practically, I should use this sunlight, but instead, I started driving slower just to enjoy the view. Now about the route to avoid. Once you reach Uttarakhand, you get two options, and no matter what, do not go from the Nagalapuram road. This road has lot of speed breakers and the reason is the small villages on the way. And on top of that, the road condition is also really bad. If you take the highlighted road, you still have to do a little off-roading, but trust me this road is way much better than the later option. By 6:30 I reached near the temple. I parked my bike and realized it's 6:45 and I forgot the charger. <laughs> In the beginning I was completely scared. even i thought to turn back and start riding towards home jab main bike park kar raha tha tab main ek director se mila aur unhone bataya ki unki team aage shooting ki taiyari kar rahi hai then i was a little relaxed it has been one hour since i started walking but still i didn't see anyone and i will get extremely scared and worried whenever i had to cross a river stream Finally after walking for 2 kilometers I saw a really small light in a far distance and I started walking towards it In these situations at night never try to cross a river stream by jumping on it there is always another way search for it and then try to take it Consider this as a safety precaution number 1 never jump to cross a river stream at night After introductions it was my job to take care of this fire because they had to do other preparations I made sure the fire stayed on and in the meanwhile I also prepared my tent After an hour rest of their team came and they all started preparing food before they can start shooting I tried to help as much as possible and made sure the fire and wood is always available. Later I even helped with shooting a small scene and when I got tired I went to sleep. I woke up at 6:30 and started preparing mentally to enter the forest. बट आगे बढ़ने से पहले मुझे ये सीन ये हरियाली जरा एंजॉय करनी थी द 
Now let's talk about the best time to visit this place. I will actually suggest to avoid coming to this place whenever it's raining. Even if it's rainy season or it's just normally raining, just avoid it. And baki ka pura bacha wa sal, jabhi bhi aa sakte ho, try to visit this place as much as possible. I thought the movie crew will join with me for the waterfall, but they explained me that they had to go ahead to do some other shooting work, so they can't visit the waterfall. तो फिर यहाँ से आगे का सफ़र मुझे अकेले ही तय करना था वंस अगेन आई वॉज अबाउट टू बी आ लोन एंड आई हैड टू एंटर दिस फॉरेस्ट एंड द रीज़न वाई आई सेड लाइक टू अवॉइड विजिटिंग दिस प्लेस इन रेनी सीजन क्योंकि बारिश के वक्त ये पूरा रिवर बैंक पानी के नीचे रहता है एक डैम भी बनाया गया है जिसके कारण फ्लड अवॉइड हो सके एंड दैट्स वाई they have built another temple where we have parked our bikes and this year during rainy season three people have already died when they tried to visit this place and they were playing in the waterfall and let's not forget that this water is coming from multiple streams of different waterfalls so if it rains somewhere else water pressure and water flow can increase in this area also that's why i recommend not to visit this place during rainy season or when it's raining now it's time to pack and move ahead now the sun is coming up i'll take the numbers and then i will say ta bye bye that's the shooting crew time to go my phone is at 20% imagine being here at night with no light at all officially i am alone now and it's time to enter the forest now in the jungle that's the way in jungle within first 5 minutes of entering the jungle i was worried like am i going on the right path and lot of other questions going through my mind jaise ki agar mujhe kuch hua what if i see any animal i can listen to the waterfall now the easiest way to find if you are going on right path is to follow the garbage i have been using this trick for really long time and it always helps dheere dheere forest aur gehra hote gaya aur dense hota gaya aur utne hi mere chehre pe 12 bajne lag gaye imagine the bungee cord getting stuck somewhere and i feel like somebody is pulling me <laughs> from behind Uh, दो तीन बार डरने के बाद मैंने फाइनली डिसाइड किया इट्स टाइम टू कीप द बंजी कॉर्ड इन साइड द बैग टू बी ऑनेस्ट राइट फ्रॉम द मिनट आई पार्क माई बाइक आई वॉज वरी एंड आई वॉज केयर एंड आई हैव टू ओवरकम दिस फियर आफ्टर हैविंग अ ब्रीफ कॉन्वर्सेशन विद माई सेल्फ आई रियलाइज दैट आई हैव बीन डूइंग दिस फॉर अ रियली लॉन्ग and there's no point of getting afraid now aur agar koi nayi problem aati hai to dekh lenge i think so on weekends lot of people do visit this place and they do drink and do party here so i will suggest to avoid coming on weekends and make sure to wear good shoes because there are beer bottles everywhere After climbing a small mountain I found a good spot it had a small waterfall and there was a pond in front so I thought I can swim here I just had to get down Ooh. Yeah. 
I was enjoying a lot until this happened. The drone lost connection with the remote and I panicked and I started running here and there. I didn't even knew in which direction I sent the drone. And I was extremely tired because of the bag. I just dropped the bag, took the remote and started going in a direction to see if the remote connects. एक किलोमीटर डाउनस्ट्रीम जाने पर कुछ भी नहीं मिला और रिटर्न आते वक्त देखा तो कुछ बंदर बैग खोलने की कोशिश कर रहे थे इसलिए फिर से बैग लेके मुझे दौड़ना पड़ा आफ्टर गोइंग इन अपोजिट डायरेक्शन आई फाइनली गॉट कनेक्टेड टू द ड्रोन बट इट केप्ट ऑन गेटिंग डिसकनेक्टेड द गुड न्यूज इज आई फाइनली फाउंड आउट इन विच डायरेक्शन माई ड्रोन इज द बैड न्यूज इज माई ड्रोन एंड रिमोट्स बैटरी इज अबाउट टू डाई The drone has a range of 12 kilometers, but I knew I didn't go far more than two or three kilometers. I'll check the video again just to see if I can get any clue. Clue number one: the drone is on the right side. Clue number two: it's on a tree, and clue number three: a cave is visible from the spot where the drone is. Now all I had to do was go under each tree and shake it to see if the drone footage moves before the battery of remote or battery of drone dies. Later I realized that because of the messed up gimbal I was getting a rotated footage and this helped me a lot. First half kilometer I didn't find anything. After searching for few hundred meters I was able to hear this noise. Son of a The drone was 12 meters up in the tree. Finally found this. Now going back to waterfall. <laughs> Look at this sweat. Look. There is still one more thing to do. By the way, if you like this video, do subscribe to this channel and hit the like button. When I reached back to this spot, I rested there. I ate my lunch and decided to swim for a while. This journey had many ups and downs. One, fear of trekking alone at night. Two, happiness of meeting a movie crew. Three, being part of a shooting for the first time. Four, courage of entering in a dense forest alone. Five, sorrow of losing a drone. Six, a huge relief of finding my drone back. This journey had been an emotional roller coaster for me. Let me know in comments how was this journey for you. 
After finishing my last bottle of water, I left the parking and headed towards Chennai. I hope this video was helpful. Do mention in comments if you have any questions. And I hope to see you guys in the next video. Thank you for watching and travel safe.